what is up boys welcome back to some more vgc 2023 and i think i'm gonna start doing this if i can commit to it i'm gonna start doing double uploads so we'll do uh these videos the ones where i'm gonna be doing the freaking uh just ranked using this team and then i'll do a showdown video uh where i'm gonna be testing out some teams using the, the paradox pokemon or whatever they're called uh, but okay i've seen this I've already seen this crap. That is what weakness policy, freaking thingy over there. With the Dragapult to activate it. Beat up also. Doesn't Dragapult get beat up or something? Jesus. Jesus. Like this game. Could it, I could go Titar maybe? I don't even know. I kind of want to go Trick Room, but... Mm, perhaps Titar should be the lead. We're gonna go Titar and Mousehold. Yeah, I think I've seen this team before. A lot of these teams are pretty much the same. I think I've seen it. I think the Armorage or whatever that thing is called is a weakness policy and they have Dragapult to activate it. Pretty sure. Not the lead I was expecting. That could still that could be final gambit. So I'm gonna follow me and we're gonna dragon dance. Could be dragon dance. Called it. Final Gambit. The trash. If he goes to Trick Room, we do have Ken Gambit. Should have him back. Oh, he's faster than me. Maybe he thought I was going to Terror or something? Hey, now we're plus one attack, and he's minus one defense. Bring out, bring out Torque, Torque, or Ken Gambit. I'm assuming he's gonna bring out his own Ken Gambit, or maybe he just brings out Indeedee. Let's bring out Torkoal. Yep, called it. Alright, we're gonna protect Tyranitar. Let's go for overheat into the Kim Gambit. Wide guard! Oh my god. Even better. Low kick. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Maybe I should start running. Because honestly, um, King Gambits are kind of a pain for me. King Gambits are kind of a pain for me. Not gonna lie. Alright. Um, we're gonna Terra. We're gonna crunch this thing. Kill it. I'm gonna go for another over here on King Gambit. We're gonna Ghost Terra. So fuck this guy and he's low key. 
kick, bro. And even though we are minus uh, two now, special attack, overheat should still be able to kill King Yamme at this range. Yeah, maybe I should put low kick on it. I don't know why. Alright, so Tyranitar was the lead, boys. Tyranitar definitely was in the lead. Crit didn't matter. That range would still kill it. Charcoal boosted. Sun boosted. Yeah, it, it, that literally did not matter. Not even a tiny bit. And now it is a 3v1. This dude is fucked. Easy little claps from Ghost Terra. Time ran it. Oh, it's Torkoal. It's their own Torky Torkoals. Alright, this protect Tyranitar? Earth power, the Torkoal. We are, we did win the speed tie. Either that or they're not a negative nature. No, 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 I'm negative nature. What the hell? So that is a speed tie. Alright. I, I honestly, I'd rather just go for crunch. I just, there's no point in risking uh, missing a rock slide. Yeah, cancel the battle. Yeah, because then we just get a free switch out into Ken Gambit anyway, and then we just kill him. So it wouldn't have mattered. I think this guy was like rank 400 or something. Jesus. So yeah. Dude, like, Annihilate is like such an annoying Pokemon, because it's like, like, usually I see bulk up, but there are these final, the, the final Gambit ones running around too. And it just sucks. It, it just... It's like, what is it? Is it bulk up? Is it fucking final gambit? And that one was final gambit. Absolutely just one-shotted my, uh, my mouse hold. So, it, it just sucks. It sucks going up against Annihilate. You just don't know what the fuck they're running with it. And then Terra, of course. It just, it just, anyone can now use any Pokemon, and they don't have to worry about anything. Because they can just Terra and re re resist a move that they're weak to now. Usually, what? Annihilates are like Fire Terra. That's usually what I see. Um, they're usually Fire Terra because they're weak to what? Fairy and shit. Stuff like that. Uh, let me see. So this guy's running a Trick Room team. Heart Trick Room team because they do have Gyarados. Uh, I kind of would like to go Mouse Hold and Tyranitar. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. That's looking quite fire. White fire indeed. And if he does want to get, tr if he wants to get Tricker Mob, Torkoal and King Gambit in the back. I think we go with the same four. Ghost Terra Tyranitar. Let's fucking go. Because Mouse Hold, we can just Population Bomb, all that stuff. We have a Clear Amulet, so in case that Gyarados. Happens to be intimidate. In case they happen to be intimidate, they have jump lift though. That can be kind of annoying with the the, the sleep powder. Yama and Toxtricity. Rather annoying. Very, very annoying. He fake he's gonna fake something out. He's gonna fake something out. I'm a, I would assume that it would be the mouse hold. You don't wanna take a population bomb to the face. So maybe I can get away with the Dragon Dance here, and we'll protect Mouse Hold. Okay, he's withdrawing Toxtricity. Oh, Gyarados. Uh, okay, that kind of sucks. So did he go straight for a Fighting-type move? Because that's going to suck. 
Because we easily could have just Terra Ghost right in his face. Okay, he just went for fake out. And he did go for the mouse hold. Yeah, so people just, people fear this little mouse family because of the fucking population bomb, right? Ariyama can have wide guard, I think. That is a thing. We're gonna Ghost Terra. Crunch. The Gyarados. Or do we just go for it? Fuck it, right? Rock Slide. Population Bomb into the uh, Ariyama. Too, man. So cringe, bro. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ariyama dies here now. I think it dies to sand? Sand and burn? No, no, no. He survived. Alright, so he's gonna go for another wide guard. He has to. I'm just gonna go for crunch. Healthy hand. Man, we could have just gone Crunch into the Gyarados. Crunch into the Gyarados and Population Bomb. Like, a lot of people are running Wide Guard now. I even called it too. I even said this fucker probably had a Wide Guard. So obvious. Should have just fucking gone for Crunch. Maybe Population Bomb and Crunch into the Gyarados slot. See, you could have just gone hoping hand crunch from the beginning. Close combat, I'll take that. Mouse hold did its job. Decent uh, decent damage to Hariyama, put in range, but now it's gonna die anyway to burn or sand. Um, helped us kill Gyarados, one shot it. Okay, so that is a. I think that was an adamant Gyarados because. Um, Oh yeah, I think that was an Adam and Gyarados because we outsped him. Because we're drawing. I think that's it, right? No, he still has... Oh, Skeletor. He still has, he still has one more. He, he still has not... Um... He still hasn't used his Terra. So I'm going to Rock Slide. And we're going to Sucker Punch Skeleturge. I'm assuming that's got to be Skeleturge. He's getting rid of that fire type. Yep. Probably. It's a grass type. Okay, perfect. So, our moves are still neutral on his ass. Still good damage. Plus one walk 
slide coming up. Caution should be flinched. Oh, damn, that sucks. <laughs> damn, that sucks. But it didn't matter, honestly. He he could have he could have one shotted our um, our our Ken Gambit right there, but it wouldn't have mattered. Like the next turn, we just go for double rock slide again and kill both of his Pokemon. Toxicity is not gonna be able to kill um, uh, Tyranitar in one shot. So yeah, we still would have won. So I guess I see why they have Grass Terra for the uh, for the Skeledurge. You since you're not people aren't gonna be going for a Fire type move into Skeledurge, and then it does and then Grass resists Water. Damn, six oh six Ghost Terra Tyranitar carrying us today, boys. Well, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you guys again next time.